Look at these English words. Do you pronounce them with a voiceless post-alveolar affricate and say cheap, chin and chop? Or is your version something like sheep, shin or shop? In which case even different meanings may be the result. Well, if this is the case, then you probably pronounce German words that begin with ch, like Tscheche or Tschüss, in a similar fashion and say Tscheche and Tschüss. So, what can we do about this? The problem is a distributional one. Both English and German have the phoneme Tsch and an allophone which occurs in final position, as in English match or in German much. However, whereas English also has an initial allophone as in chief, this allophone does not occur in German. In fact, it is often realized as sch, as in chef. How can we solve this problem and pronounce the affricate even word initially? Well, apart from the fact that we can produce ch word finally, as in much, kitsch or quatsch, we can use these German words as a starting point for words with initial ch. The trick is quite simple. Say much and add an English word starting with ch. So we have, for example, much cheap. Now drop the initial syllable ma and you're there. Ma cheap becomes cheap. Alternatively, you can use a short glottal stop in front of the English words and the effect is virtually the same. You get a cheap, a chin and a chop. So it's simple, isn't it? I hope my advice helps and you will no longer find it difficult to produce present-day English words with an initial ch.